Greetings, everyone. I am about to sublimate a t-shirt. What I am using, what I do is I put copy paper and put the computer down so you can see. Copy paper in between the sheet, the shirt, so the ink won't spew through the t-shirt, the front of the back of the t-shirt. Always remember to put something in between, something flat. I use copy paper, I use wax paper, or I would use butcher paper. Make certain that it's lying flat so you won't have any creases inside of your your shirt when it is printing. Let me show you exactly what I did. See how flat? See how flat that is? Put this back so you can see exactly what I'm doing. I printed out my image already. This will be the image. It's Mother's Day weekend, weekend next week. Make certain that you measure out. Lay it flat. You did your measurements. I use a tape measure. And then what I do always, always, always tape your image on your shirt because when you lift up your press, your garment, the, the paper can slide and then your colors will be all over your shirt. You'll have a lot of smears all over your shirt. And I put my press on 400 at 60 seconds. And what I, let me show you exactly what I did. Is this how I tape? And you use butcher paper on top of your image. I cover all. And then your protector. I don't know the name of this offhand right now. Press and hold. Remember, make certain. Let me show you exactly what I'm. Remember, make certain this is down tight enough. Because if it's not tight enough, the press, I, I touched it and it's hot. So it can be tight enough so the ink can go through the garment and be popping. Make certain it's not too loose. Always adjust it as need it for any different item that you have. I have it extremely tight down. Now this is gonna be kinda of hot, so be careful taking your tape off. This is not any type of tape, this is heat press tape. It's a little wrinkle. Well, the paper underneath this wrinkle because I'm trying to show you. See how the color is popping? See? Make certain this is 400 at 60 degrees and this is tightened. Get you some, some oven mittens or something like that to deal with 
taking the items off of the garments, the mugs, or the tumblers.